Hey, Barflies, welcome back to another episode of Behind the Bar Liquor Reviews, Late Night Munchies. Got Justin with me, and Kylie, and tonight we have got something that went viral earlier this week from the town of Webster, right next to where we live. It is the Rhino's Dill Pickle Pizza. I don't know what to say. <laughs> I love pickles. I yep. love pizza. Yep. I have no idea what to think about this. It it blew up on Facebook and Twitter, Instagram, all right. those things, and uh, they said they were getting calls from people in Ohio looking for recipes and how to make it. It's like a garlic pizza and dill and dill pickles. And we figured since it blew up on the internet, we might as well try it. Let's see so, what it does. Let's go. All right. So everyone can see that. Yeah. It's it smells like pickles in here. not bad. No. It works a lot better than I thought it would work. It's, it's definitely interesting though. I don't know that I'd want to eat a whole... I, whole I'm actually content. Away. Yeah, I've got the one bite. It's good. It's not bad. It's just different. I think it's just that the juxtaposition of the sour and it's, the garlic and everything is... I wouldn't buy another one. No. It was $17.99 for the medium, uh, plus taxing. It came to like $19 and change, whatever it was. It, it was good. Yeah. For a was. bite. I mean, you cut this into little bite sized pieces, maybe, had it for an appetizer before. Maybe I could do it, but a lot of salt and a lot of dill. Yeah. It's a little too much of everything. But it, it's not bad. Mm -hmm. it, it's definitely good. I'm not saying it's a bad pizza or anything, but. I don't know. It, I think it just went viral because of how odd it was, and it seemed like when they wrote up the article on it, a lot of people said that they liked it. So yeah, it's. I, I could see why a pickle enthusiast would love it. I do like a, pickles very much, but I also like pizza very much, like I said. But <laughs> I don't think you need to put them together. Yeah, definitely worth trying it though. I mean, maybe some hot sauce on it. Maybe we should add some other condiments they, down they here. Try dipping it in ranch, but I don't think that would be good. No, not even a little bit. Th I think that'd be too much sour. Oh my god, sour. That'd be awful. Yeah, yeah some reflux in the Lord. <sighs> so, what are you giving this on? Out of a ten, let's go. I'm gonna give it a six. Mostly creativity. It's not bad tasting. It's not something I'm driving out of my way to go get them right. by any means. Right. But I can see why it went viral. It's it's pickles and everybody loves pickles and pizza. Yeah. I was I was about a five or a six in my mind and so I'll, I'll say a six also. You know what we should do is uh ship it up to our buddy Ken at KBD Productions. He hates pickles. Mm. Now one up in Canada see if it makes it through customs. Let's just see how that gets there. <laughs> Anyways Butterflies, did you hear about this on social media this week since it just went insanely viral? Let us know in the comments below if you want. If you're in the Rochester, New York area and you want to check this out, Rhino's Pizzeria in Webster, New York. They're the ones that came up with this and went crazy with it. And, uh, you know, give them a shout. Pick one up, try it, maybe get a small just to try it out. Yeah, eleven ninety nine for the small. Yeah, I don't think you're going to want a large one. No, no. So, anyways, give us a thumbs up if you like the video. Thumbs down if you dislike the video. Like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Make sure you check out our merch store. And we'll see you on the next episode. Cheers. <laughs>